Baltimore City attorneys are setting the stage for a court battle against Big Pharma, announcing today the city will sue drug makers for their roles in the ongoing opioid crisis. WJZ is live. Kimberly Eaton with what they plan to argue. Kimberly. Well, just illegal drugs top the list of killers in Baltimore, and now city attorneys want Big Pharma to pay the cost of fighting the opioid crisis. This, more than ever before, becomes a life sentence for drug users. In the first nine months of 2017 alone, opioids killed more than 1,500 people in Maryland and left a trail of nearly 600 bodies on the streets of Baltimore. There are more people dying from overdose here in Baltimore City than there are dying from homicide. Now, city attorneys want the drug makers who sell these quiet killers to answer in court. They were reckless, they were intentional. It was marketing, it was greed, and we're going to try to hold them accountable for the harm that they've caused to Baltimore City. City solicitor Andre Davis announced Wednesday he will file a lawsuit saying manufacturers and distributors of dangerous drugs have devastated Baltimore and in the process stuck the city with a big tab for things like law enforcement and health department initiatives aimed at fighting the epidemic. In one way or another, the city pays for every prescription. The big name defendant in the case, Purdue Pharma. The homepage of the company's website links to a letter addressing the opioid crisis. But Davis says he's going after everyone from leaders in the drug industry to local pill mills. All dangerous, all damaging. To the city, to the people of the city, to the financial uh, well being of the city. And if the city wins, any money would go into the general fund and then be used to pay back the police, the health department, and any other city departments tap financially to fight the opioid crisis. Reporting live tonight, I'm Kimberly Eaton for WJZ. Kimberly, thank you. The lawsuit will be filed in state circuit court. City attorneys say that they will fight to keep it there.